Yo, what is going on, guys? Yazzy2 back here again with another NFL video. And now we have four teams left the Bucks, Packers, Bills, and Chiefs. Super excited for these matchups. They're going to be great games tomorrow. And so, just like all the other weeks, I'm going to go to last week's games, which are right here. Look at my results from last week. Then talk about these two games and do my picks for these games so yeah let's just hop right in and not waste any time so our first game last weekend was the uh, rams first the packers um right over here the packers uh beat the rams by quite a bit 32 18 jared goff 1 td 174 21 of 27 which is not bad but then aaron Rodgers 23 36 296 and two td passes which is pretty good um, so yeah, pretty pretty dominant game over there. And then Bill Chiefs, super low scoring game. It's a great game. Lamar Jackson actually got injured this game, which was pretty disappointing. Um, so hopefully he's alright. But uh yeah, he did okay. One one interception, one sixty two yards and fourteen of twenty four. While Josh Allen did got twenty three of thirty seven, two oh six, one T D, which is not that bad either uh browns chiefs 22 17 this was super close as you might know patrick mahomes did get injured concussion um though he will be back for next week so that's good for chiefs fans um baker mayfield went 23 for 37 for 204 yards one td and one pick while patrick mahomes went 21 for 30 255 for one td and then last but not least we have the bucks versus saints this was an okay game. I mean, the Bucks, the Bucks did pretty good. Um, they had three interceptions, which was really good. Drew Brees threw for one TD, one thirty-four, nineteen for thirty-four. Um, Tom Brady threw eighteen for thirty-eight. Sorry, eighteen for thirty-three, one hundred ninety-nine yards, two TDs. Um, and as you may know, Drew Brees might. This might have been Drew Brees' last game. Um, so yeah, that's, that'd be pretty disappointing if it was, but, um, he's getting pretty old, so. So yeah, there, those were my NFL Divisional Round games, um, and now let's look at my results for those games. Um, so I did score 120 points compared to the week before, when I scored 80 points, so this was a better week for me. So I got Packers and Will Rogers record a pass touchdown in the first half. So I got both of these correct. Um, we'll record more rushing yards. Aaron Jones, this was a super close one. Um, 99 versus 90. Aaron Jones just had this amazing 60 or 62 yard gain um, at the beginning of the third quarter, I believe, um, which basically sealed him the win. And then which of these players will record the most receiving yards? Uh, I picked Stephon Diggs, which was correct um, by a lot. And then who will win this matchup? I said the Ravens, which was one of the very few that I got incorrect. Um, who will record more passing plus rushing yards? J Josh Allen got this one. And if Lamar Jackson didn't get injured at the end, maybe he would have won, but we wouldn't know. Um, will either team score 30 plus points? I said no, which was correct um, because the score was 17 to 3. Uh, who will win this matchup, the Chiefs or the Browns? I said the Chiefs, which was correct. Who will record a higher completion percentage? Patrick Mahomes with 70%, uh, Baker Mayfield with 62%. And when Mahomes went down, I was kind of worried that I'd get this one wrong, but he did do good while he was in the game, so um, that was pretty good. Who will record more receiving plus rushing yards? Tyreek Hill with 119 compared to Chubb with 73 which of these players will record the most receptions this round? Now, I'm very surprised that Michael Thomas didn't get any receptions, and I'm very surprised that Mike Evans only got one. I'd expected them to at least get four or five at the least, um, but Kelsey did get the most, which I did pick. It was close, Landry or Kelsey, but Kelsey did prevail. Um, who will win this matchup, Bucks or Saints? I got the Bucks right. And then, who are Cormor passing yards, Brady or Breeze? I got Brady correct with 199 compared to 134. And lastly, well, Kamara scored touchdown. I said yes, um, but it was actually no. He did not score touchdown, which was very surprising. And how many total points will we score this round? The correct answer was 159, though I said 295. So um, I did pretty good. I only got two wrong this week, which I'm pretty happy about. So hopefully we can keep it up for the conference championship. Um, so before we get to those picks, let's review the games. 
So, um, first up at 3.05 tomorrow is the Buccaneers at the Packers. And supposedly in uh, Green Bay tomorrow, it's supposed to be freezing cold. So we'll see if that plays a big factor. Um, and I know that from uh, the Tampa Bay Bucks, being from Tampa Bay, they probably don't experience much cold weather. So that might impact their game a little bit. Um, so yeah, 14 and 3 versus 13 and 5. The battle between two number 12 QBs, um, Aaron Rodgers, Tom Brady. So that's going to be pretty exciting. And then we have Bills versus Chiefs. Um, sorry, Bills at Chiefs. Great game as well, 15 and 3 versus 15 and 2. Um, now Patrick Mahomes is expected to play, which is good for Chiefs fans. Um, not good for Bills fans, but um, this is going to be a good game, in my opinion. I mean, both of them will be good games, but um, yeah. And then after that, we have the Super Bowl, but let's not jump the gun yet. So let, let's just do my picks and see what I got. Who will win this matchup, the Bucks or the Packers? Now, this is a 27% pick versus 73% pick. These are going to be really tough, in my opinion, but um, at the end, I have to go with the Packers. I mean, number one versus number five, Aaron Rodgers. I just feel like he's going to do better in this game. Uh, what will occur first in the game? Tom Brady pass touchdown, Tom Brady interception, Aaron Rodgers pass touchdown, or Aaron Rodgers interception. Now, this one's... I mean, it all depends really on who gets the ball first. I mean, if the Bucks get the ball first, high percent chance that Aaron... Or, sorry, Tom Brady will get a pass touchdown. Though, if Packers get the ball first, Aaron Rodgers will probably throw a pass TD. So, um, it's really luck of the draw here, but I think I'm going to go Aaron Rodgers pass TD. Um, will Devontae Adams score touchdown in the first half? Now, 73% pick yes, 27% pick no. I am going to go with the upstand pick no for this one. Who will record more completions, Brady or Rodgers? Um, I think for this, I'm going to want to go back and see how they did last week. Um, Packers, Aaron Rodgers got 23 for 36, which is pretty good. While Brady got 18 for 33, so Rodgers did better. Um, so I think Aaron Rodgers will get the better completion, more completions. Um, who will record more receiving yards? Now, this one... I'm pretty sure I'm going to pick Devontae Adams. I mean, Mike Evans didn't do well that last week. And I know this is a different week, but I feel like Devontae Adams will get a higher or more receiving yards. Who will record more sacks? Now, this one is really tough. I don't know much about either of these defenses. Um, so I am going to come back to this one. Who will record the most rushing yards this game? Aaron Jones, Leonard Fournette, Ronald Jones, or any other player? I'm going to go Aaron Jones. I think he'll have a good game. And yeah. Uh, who will win this matchup? The Bills or the Chiefs? I am going to go Bills for this one. Uh, we can see it's very close 51% versus 49%. Um, who will score the first touchdown of the game? Stephon Diggs, Tyreek Hill, Travis Kelsey, or any other player? And most people did pick any other player. But again, this really goes with who's going to get the ball first. I mean, if the Chiefs get the ball first, it might be Hill or Kelsey. If the Bills get the ball first, it might be Diggs. Um, so I am going to come back to this one because I'm not sure. Will Tyreek Hill score 20-plus yard reception in the first half? Sorry, I didn't mean to pick no. Um, I think I'm mostly going to come back to this one. Um, who will record more passing yards, Allen or Mahomes? Um, I'm also going to go back to last week and see how each did. So, passing yards over here. Allen got 206, while Mahomes got 255. So, Mahomes did do better. I'm, I'm going to go Mahomes. Um, I think he'll have a really good game. So, yeah. Will either Josh Allen or Patrick Mahomes record a rushing touchdown? I am going to go no. Uh, upset again. Who will record more receptions, Kelsey or Diggs? For this one, I'm also going to go back to last week, see how each did. I know Kelsey got eight, but let me just see how Diggs did. Um, 
Stephon Diggs, oh, eight receptions too. So they both got eight. Yeah, this is also going to be very tough. Um, Yeah, let me come back this one as well. How many points will be scored? So I think this is, yeah, for Bills and Chiefs. <sighs> I think I'm also going to go 46 to 55 points. So let's just go back to all the ones I skipped real quick. Um, let's see. Yeah, who will record more sacks? Again, I'm going to look at last week, see how each did. So Packers and Bucks. Um, so Packers over here. Defense. Let's see, one and a half, one and a half, so three, four. Yeah, so if my calculations are correct, they got four sacks, whereas the Bucks defense got, wow, the Bucks defense didn't get any sacks. I think I'm just going to go Packers defense for this one. I don't know why, I'm just, I feel like they'll do good. Um, who will score the first touchdown of the game? Uh, yeah, I'm really on the fence about this one. Here I'm gonna go Kelsey upset. Will Tyree Kill score twenty record a twenty yard reception in the first half? Yes, I'm gonna say he will. Um and then who will record more receptions? Yeah, I'm just gonna say Diggs for this one. I feel like he gets passed to a lot and he's gonna win this one. So yeah, and then how many combined rushing yards will be recorded this round? I think I'm just going to put out a number and just say um, 297 is my guess. So yeah, um, now like I always do, I'm going to give you score predictions for each game and then wrap it up. So um, Bucks at Packers, I, I'm going to say 31 to 27, the Packers will win. So by four. Um... Let's see the and then the Bills Chiefs. I'm going to say the Bills will win 31 to 30 is my prediction. So yeah, pretty close games. Um and so yeah, that's gonna do it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and comment down your picks. Who who do you think's gonna win? And I'll talk to you guys next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.